car. Yeah. Yeah. Get my get yeah. Good yeah. It's July 1st, 2012. And we are at San Diego International Airport. We've got Twitter rocking here. We got our staff. And we're heading back to Cleveland. Yeah. Looks like Colt's still bitching about his power outage. Well. Well. Oh, yeah. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, hey. Okay. Okay. Uh, there should be boys. That is the smart car of aviation, but it will get us where we need to go. I believe it's an Embraer 120 Bristilian, if that's how it's said. And uh, the plan is we fly from here, San Diego, to Los Angeles, and then from Los Angeles to Cleveland direct on an Airbus A320, so that'll be much nicer. Ladies and gentlemen, downtown San Diego, the last view for what, about a month? Two months? Three months? I'll be back. Here she be. We're going out there this way. I haven't gotten on a plane or off a plane like this since Las Vegas. This has got to be the oldest terminal at San Diego International here. It's a little derelict, but uh, it's still better than Hopkins. But this is the commuter terminal here. Uh, it looks like it had a lot of power. A couple powers? How many horsepower? A couple hundred horsepower. Actually, it's probably not as much as we think. Not quite as many pound feet of thrust as that.
Typical road eggs, <laughs> wannabe. So here's where we got off that little uh, Embraer from San Diego, and there's where we're going to Cleveland. What are the odds of that? It is across the aisle. Now we're filming. Ridiculous. All right. We are on the A320 from Continental. This time it says United, but this is just, well, it's the same thing now, but the paint's all painted up like this, which I guess says United now, but anyways, so those are the last palm trees for a month or two, I think, and uh, Fuyin, we're ready to go. So it's almost 419, and we'll be out shortly. I'll never find it, but there's downtown LA, LAX, Marina Del Rey, Culver City. Um, yep. See, what a beautiful city. As much smog as there is, I love LA. I really do. Cleveland. Hate it as much as I love it. Here's the IX Center. And the 320. How do we do? Touchdown. Come on. A uh, little rough. Not bad. Any sound landing is a good land. That's the familiar sound of sprinklers. It is about 2.15 in the morning here on the East Coast, at least the East Coast time zone. Uh, so 2 o'clock here makes me think it's 11 o'clock. I've been on Pacific time for two weeks. So we're home. Familiar sights of my garage, the Accord, <laughs> and the M5. Yes, yes, I've missed it. I've missed a three-pedal car. I did drive the Ferrari, but that's still a two-pedal car, so it lacks that, but it's got everything else in terms of drivability. But anyways, uh, I'm not really tired. Um, notice that, my wheel's back. I, I had the, uh, you know, I, when I was gone, I took the wheel off and they fixed the ding in there and here's the new tire and I, I put that on. It's not really torqued down right. But tomorrow, I'm going over to uh, NTB and I'm gonna have them put on these new brake rotors, which I don't know if I showed you, but those are the new front brake rotors, which will stop the squeaking. There's the extra front wheel that's going on the front because the front right one, the front right one is really dinged up. So while they're putting the other new tire on the back and the front new brake rotors, I'm gonna have them take this wheel and just swap the tire. That tire's fine. So that'll be you know $13 in mounting a tire. And I got new air filters, k and That's kind of what I had, but the ones I have, I know they're washable, but I just got new ones because they're cheap. 
least I think they're cheap. And these are the old um, tail light turn signal bulbs. They were orange. And you know me, I'm very persnickety with things. And when you got back behind the car like this, you could see little orange dots in there where they were, and they always look burnt out. So I bought the silver ones. These are the old ones. I've already swapped them out. So I just put the silver ones in, and they still light up amber because turn signals have to be amber apparently in the United States like this light is orange slash amber and so is the front one so now they look clear but they're still legal which is good and as you know that light that I got and put in was defective so I had the guy send me another package I just got home he said it's been sent for two weeks it's not here why isn't it here I wanted to switch that light tonight so I sent him another email We'll see where that is, if he can get me a tracking number, what's going on with that, I don't know. Because it doesn't work, I hit the brakes, nothing happens, those lights work fine, the reverse light doesn't work, and when you turn on this turn signal, the brake light and the reverse light flash, and that flickers. So I don't know what's up with that, it's probably just a wiring problem. So tomorrow's going to be very busy, and I need to get to bed so I can actually wake up tomorrow and have all this stuff done with the car. Now I know that I didn't really explain anything. I have hinted about 2419 forever. Well, most of you figured out that's the mileage between Hudson, Ohio and San Diego, California. My dad moved there. His job was up here. The apartment was up here. There's more jobs there than here, and he's always wanted to live there, so that's why he's there. I helped drive his car out there and all the stuff and pack, move him into the apartment. That's why I did that. That only took a few days, and the rest of the time was enjoyable in SoCal. Well, now we're back here in Ohio, where the last 10 days have been very hot, there's been no rain and everybody's yard is brown. And you know me, I hate that. So that's why I'm watering. Because my yard is not where I like it. It's not up to par. So I've got four yards to mow. And uh, sorry for more secrets, but 338 is happening soon. So my plans are I'm just going to water for a couple hours tonight. When I get up tomorrow, I'll move them around and turn them back on. And hopefully I'll have everything nice and green and growing again in a week or ten days or however long it takes. I don't even remember. I haven't had to bring a yard back forever. But the car hasn't started in two weeks. It's just been sitting here. And um, I've kind of, you know, I've unlocked it. I've messed with it. I've played with the lights. The trunk was open. I've used a little bit of power. So I really hope it starts tomorrow. It's too late now. I don't want to wake everybody up. So uh, we'll give that a shot tomorrow. Anyways, flew home today, uh, San Diego to L.A., L.A. home. Uh, decent flights, Airbus A320. Not nearly as nice as United's jet. This was Continental's. Um, but it's done. Great trip. Canon came along definitely unforgettable. So that is going to be it for me today. A lot of footage from the plane and flying and that was an amazing two weeks in Southern California with my dad and now he lives there and I live here so that kind of sucks but um, I'm hoping to have the opportunities to go out there every couple of months or whatever and visit him and there's definitely room for me to stay there but he's in the job hunt now so we'll hope all things go well and uh, the vlogs will resume, resume normal time schedules and We'll go back to normal now. So it's hot, there's no rain, it's been sunny every day. That means we're going back to the pool. Welcome to summer. It's July 2nd. Talk to you guys tomorrow, technically still today, on the 2nd. And uh, we'll kick summer off. We kind of already did, but now we'll start normal summer. Good night.